Hi guys, welcome back to this new tutorial about Git. So far you have learned how to add, commit, rename and move files inside Git. But there are just a few other commands that you need to learn to become more comfortable with Git. One of them is deleting a file and that's what this video and the next will be all about. Without further ado, let's get started. Let's run a pwd command and see where we are in our git directory. As you can see we are inside our root directory. And let's now choose a file for deletion by running an ls. And as you can see we have two text files and as a matter of fact let's keep these files here and create another file that will be our dummy file for deletion. So let's first run a git status command. And as you can see, we're starting from a clean working directory, right? And let me go ahead and create a file via Sublime Text. Sublime, and let's call it delete demo.txt. Sublime Text will open the file for editing. And let's say this is a dummy file for deletion. So right. save the file and close Sublime Text. Right. Well, you could leave the file empty as it doesn't really impact our commands anyway. Um, but let's go ahead and run a git status now. And I bet by now you are familiar with this output. But if you're not, that's okay. Uh, git basically shows here that the file lies in the working directory and it's not tracked by git. Uh, as you can see, uh, it lies under the untracked files headings. So this will be the first case of our demonstration, namely deleting an untracked file. Right, so deleting this text file, for deleting this text file, Git has a special command called rm from remove. So if you go ahead and try this command, so it's git rm, and in this case, the name of the file, in our case, delete demo.txt. Let's press enter. And as you can see, git throws in an error. In this case, the name of the file does not match any, any of the git tracked files. So, as you can clearly tell, this command cannot be used if git doesn't track the file. Um, but, but we still uh, have another option. We can still use bash's identical rm command and type in rm delete demo.txt and if we press enter and do an ls as you can see delete demo.txt is no longer in our root repository. Let's run a git status and as you can see there's nothing to commit and the working directory is clean and that's because the file was untracked so even though we created it and deleted it git still sees the working directory as clean now because we eventually deleted it so please remember that if you need to delete an untracked file do that using a uh, bashes remove command not, not gits uh, as git is not yet aware of this file. Right, in the second video I'll proceed with the second case of my file deletion demonstration by showing you the process of deleting a tracked file. This was a short video. I hope you found it useful. Make sure you address any questions you may have in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.